I want to talk about uh, how at least my nation is creating a bundle of drug addicts. Uh, a friend of mine, a nurse, uh, was reading a book. I believe the horses, the, the, the wildest colts make the best stallions. I think it was something like that. It was referring that, the, that the, when the, that wild energy is there, then the, it, it makes the best and, uh, adult. And she said, read this paragraph. And she said, but I don't, and she covered over the rest of the stuff. And so I read the paragraph, and I said, okay, you've just described my children, right? They move from activity to activity. They can't sit very long. They're very curious. They, and she said, and it was all these things that kids are. And she said, what this is in this book, it is, it's referring to, is the diagnostic parameters for hyperactivity so that they can give children Ritalin. I said, but these are normal kids. This is a normal, this is how kids are. She said, I know, I know, and I'm a nurse. I'm just pointing out to you uh, how things are out there. And I was in Zurich one time, and this mom had a little boy. She said, I want you to work on him. He's hyperactive. And I said, okay. And it was her only child at the time. And they came in, and uh, I put him on the adjusting table, and I adjusted him, and I talked to him, and I said, uh, why don't you jump down for a minute and go sit over there? And I handed him a toy. And I said to his mom, why don't you get on the table? She said, why would I get on the table? I said, well, I really think that I should work with the problem. And she said, what do you mean by that? And I said, well, you know, uh, he's not a problem. Look at him. He's, a, he's just a perfectly normal. He's not hyperactive. He's a boy. They have a lot of energy. They're wild. And I said, the wilder they are, the more fun they are, if you can look at it like that. I said, but the problem is you're concerned about this, and you think that there's something wrong, and there isn't. So I was working on her, doing my kinesiology and my chiropractic, and she was responding pretty well, and he was sitting, and, I, and he went to get up, and I said, hey, excuse me. I, I said, would you sit back down for just a minute? And he said, yeah. And he sat back down, and she said, how are you doing that? And I said, first of all, I'm telling him what I want him to do. She said, what? I said, I'm not telling him what I don't want him to do. I'm not saying don't get up and run around. I'm saying just sit there for a few more minutes. And I said, when I get done with your mom, then we can play or do whatever. And I find most people tell their children what they don't want them to do. And they say, don't run around, don't scream, don't yell. Instead of, hey, would you sit down and be quiet for a bit? And the child, the knots and don'ts don't really, it's, it's a meta-language thing. If I say, don't think of yellow monkeys with red sneakers, boy, by golly, for just a second, you have no choice but think about that. So if you're working with kids, uh, the first thing to do is... Uh, get my wife's book, Rule Number One, Mom Has Fun, because it should be fun for everybody as far as we're concerned. If you don't have fun with them, don't buy the book. <laughs> and I mean, let's not be confusing here. Uh, the second thing is, Nicole has a 120-day course, which is absolutely fascinating. It works extremely well for uh, uh, parents. It gives them practical things to do to get, their, to get into a wonderful relationship with their children. But as a start, tell your kids what you want them to do. Leave that glass there. That's my glass. Sit and be quiet for a few minutes. You know, don't touch the glass. They hear touch the glass. Don't run around and scream. They hear run around and scream. So, rule number one, tell people what you expect of them. Usually they'll do it because people aren't out to be sinister with you. They're just out to live their lives. Have a fun day. Glad talking to you. www.micpeakperformance.com and www.momhasfun, rule number one.com, momhasfun.com is Nicole stuff. Thanks for listening. Bye.